June 24, 2013, former Italian Prime Minister Silvio Berlusconi is found guilty of abusing his power and engaging in sex with an underage prostitute, and is sentenced to seven years in prison. Silvio Berlusconi, then Prime Minister of Italy, was accused and formally convicted of paying 17-year-old Moroccan Karima Elmrag, also known by the stage name Ruby Rubicuori, for sexual services between February and May 2010 when she was under 18. He was found not guilty on appeal. He was found not guilty on appeal also, formally convicted of malfeasance in office by arranging to have Elmrug released from police detention during an incident in which she was briefly held on claims of theft. On June 24, 2013, the court of first instance sentenced Berlusconi to seven years in prison, and banned him from public office for life. Berlusconi appealed the sentence, and on July 18, 2014, an appeals court overturned Berlusconi's conviction, thus, making him once again eligible to hold elected office. June 24, 2021. Surfside Condominium Collapse On June 24, 2021, at approximately 1.22 a.m. EDT, Champlain Towers South, a 12-story beachfront condominium in the Miami suburb of Surfside, Florida, United States, partially collapsed. 98 people died. Four people were rescued from the rubble, but one died of injuries shortly after arriving at the hospital. 11 others were injured. Approximately 35 were rescued the same day from the uncollapsed portion of the building, which was demolished 10 days later. The Surfside collapse is tied with the Knickerbocker Theater collapse as the third deadliest structural engineering failure in United States history, behind the Hyatt Regency walkway collapse and the collapse of the Pemberton Mill. If you enjoyed the video, then please subscribe the channel, it's a click for you, but a world for me. Thank you and have a nice day.